JMB. Today is Friday, February 3rd. I'm Shania Houston. And I'm Jessica Wilkes. Please stand for the pledge to the flag and remain standing for the alma mater. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Attention students with library books, return and re renew your book before 3 o'clock today and your fine will be deleted. The promised prom dress giveaway is coming up tomorrow at the Univer Unitarian Universalist Hall at 28112 Old Ocean City Road from 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. Senior girls who demonstrate financial need can choose from over 400 free prom gowns, makeup, and jewelry. All you need is a voucher from your guidance counselor in order to attend. See your guidance counselor for more information. Attention juniors and seniors, if you are taking a college class, you need to bring the registration form to your guidance counselor ASAP. The Career and Technology Education Department at Parkside High School is hosting the 33rd Annual Skills USA Local Championship Competition tomorrow. We extend this invitation to everyone and encourage you to see the competition and the many exciting things students and teachers are doing in the CTE department. The competition will be held at Parkside High School from 8 a.m. to 11.30 a.m., followed by the award ceremony in the auditorium. Juniors, donations of candy like M&M's, Kit Kats, Twix, Hershey bars, Skittles, Starburst, and bags of chips, pretzels, etc. are needed for the rock and roll concession sales. Please send in any donations to Miss Davies in the English Wing or Miss Riggins in the nurse's office as soon as possible. Also, please contact them if you are able to volunteer and work the last two weekends in February. Thank you. Now over to Jessica for the rest of the announcements. Freshmen, donations of pre-wrapped candy and red or pink paper are needed for our Valentine Candy Gram fundraiser. Please send in any donations to Ms. Webster in the Science Wing or Ms. Schuhart by Wednesday, February 8th. Thank you. In sports yesterday, boys basketball fell to Stephen Decatur 67 to 77, and girls basketball fell 31 to 47. To all athletes interested in playing football next season, there is a mandatory meeting on Monday, February 6th after school in the gym. It is expected that all will attend. If you have an excuse, see Coach Mills or Coach Gibson before the meeting. There will be a 3v3 basketball tournament to benefit Hoops for Heart on the afternoon of Friday, February 17th. All participants must have a 2.0 GPA and be in good academic standing, standing to participate. Pick up a registration packet from any PE teacher and get your team of three or four players together. The cost is $20 per team to benefit the American Heart Association. Return all registration sheets and donations to Ms. Elliott by Wednesday, February 15th to be entered. Save the date and mark your calendars. Any girl interested in trying out for softball this spring is invited to our final interest meeting before tryouts on Tuesday, February 21st from 2.50 to 3.30 in the Clippers Galley. The meeting is strongly recommended. If you haven't tried out for another sport this school year, you must have your completed physical packet by Tuesday, February 28th. If you have any questions and are concerns, see Coach Fitzgerald and Effling. Any student who entered who either worked on the Rock and Roll Revival lighting or camera crew last year and would like to work this year, or any student who did not work on either crew last year but would be interested in working this year, needs to see Miss Centennio in the chorus room before today at 2.45. You must be able to work all rehearsals and shows, so check your schedules before contacting, contacting Miss Centennio. And that's all we have for you today, JMB. Have, have a, a great, great day, day JMB. JMB. Got it.
Hits. Ah! 